A trial is underway for a former Granite Hills High School teacher and football coach accused of sexual misconduct with a teenage girl. Gerald Lopez was arrested more than two years ago after the girl's mother said that she discovered what was going on and then reported him to the school. NBC 7's Audra Stafford was in the courtroom as she recounted those days, those weeks and months leading up to that discovery. The girl's mother took the stand first thing this morning, and she talked about the night that she says she discovered a string of inappropriate text messages on her 17-year-old daughter's Apple Watch between her and her former English teacher. The judge would not allow our camera in the courtroom, but Gerald Lopez, pictured here, sat quietly as the girl's mother fought back tears. She said she discovered the text messages about a week after graduation and that they included suggestive mirror selfies of her daughter. The mother said she immediately called her sister over and they called Lopez from her daughter's phone. He answered and after discovering who was actually calling, apologized over and over. The mother said she went to Granite Hills High School the very next day and reported it to the principal. Soon after, Lopez was arrested and charged with multiple felony and misdemeanor counts, including possession of child pornography and annoying or molesting a child. Police say over a several month period, he and the girl exchanged more than 8,000 text messages, including sexually suggestive images of Lopez. Lopez has pleaded not guilty to the charges and is out on bail, but if convicted, he faces more than four and a half years in state prison and would have to register as a sex offender for life. From El Cajon, I'm Audra Stafford, NBC7. Lopez was initially put on unpaid leave, but it was later announced that he was no longer working for the district.